It's like, Do you think that our environment has an impact on our testosterone? Hundred percent. What we yeah. eat, what we drink, the air we breathe. So I'll tell you, I'll give you eight suggestions on how to naturally boost your testosterone. Oh, here we go. And okay, number one, exercise and lift weights. There you go. Holla. And uh, let's number, go. Number one, I like that's number one. Crap. Yeah. <laughs> number two, nutrition. You got to eat protein, fats, carbs. Go. You know, I mean, you're gonna have to have a healthy nutrition and and you know take care of your body. Mm -hmm. And a lot of people that come into me. They, you know, if you could teach them to how to exercise and how to eat, you're yeah. going to solve a lot of their problems. And I, I truly believe that. And I think yeah. in medicine, oh, we absolutely. cover things up with med, med, you know, like, hey, I'm just going to give you a shot of testosterone. You're going to be fine. No, that the, they need to have fundamental lifestyle changes. Yep. Um, yes. That's, that's Amen. Gonna, that's going to be the most. Number three. How many people don't even reach number one and number two? I mean, how many people out of everybody taking in that sense just probably don't do number one and number two really that well something to think about I mean, yeah, that's look at america i mean we, yeah yeah it's yeah it's crazy um number three get some sun take some vitamin d supplements be outside be outside sunning your balls sunning your sunning balls, balls. facts no. or foolishness i know foolishness okay but some sun no <laughs> no it's the best i don't know there's no studies to really show go it. out there downward dog for the neighbors <laughs> but uh just being outside getting some sun and i'll tell you i'll tell you why because our testosterone is released with circadian rhythm so when you look at young guys their testosterone um, you get this surge in the morning when they wake up and they see sun. Mm -hmm. And if you, you get, I got a lot of police officers, firefighters that work night shifts and their testosterone's out of whack because they're not seeing sun. They're sleeping during, they're sleeping oh, okay. during the day because they're, they're up, up all at night. night. And, yeah. and it's like, you know, it's, it's, it correlates with it so much. So when you sure. first get up, um, the best thing you can do is to get outside, see sun. Don't put sunglasses on when you drive to work. Be in be in sunlight. Oh, I know sunglasses Sunday. are terrible. Yeah, reset your brain. Yes, yes, yes. I mean, I keep it, telling people stop wearing sunglasses. You're doing yourself a disservice. I, I, I think not in the sun that much. My my brother is a eye doctor, and he, trust your eyeballs in me hand. I'm trust your balls in me hand. But <laughs> he, he, I mean, I think he would say wear sunglasses if you're out throughout the day to highlight and stuff. But you do want to see some sun, and you do want to get exposure. Sunscreen is great, but you need sun. It's part of our. Uh, I don't believe in sunscreen. That's my unpopular opinion. Oh, I don't know. That's not. I don't either. I don't. Ever yeah, wear, I don't. Really I never either. wear sunscreen. I, you know. I, I, mm -mm. But you need to get some sun in, into your body. So, yeah. Um, that's that's number four. Number five, um, some supplements. I think zinc supplements support healthy testosterone levels. We'll talk about more. I, I love Joe Rogan, and I, and I, I like this this Andrew Huberman. Um, Huberman, yeah. yeah. Huberman. Oh, yeah. I, I just watched some of his stuff getting ready for this, and, and he gives some awesome my awesome yeah, advice does. on there. And there's there's other supplements out there. We can Fidoji Agresta and um Tongan Ali. You ever look at right. those? Yeah, Tongan yeah. Ali. Tongan Ali, Fidoji Agresta. What the, what that does is it decreases, and we can talk about like, but the, the basic how testosterone works is we have this testosterone level. When you check it in your blood test, you're looking at your total testosterone. And that's just, that's, that's not a good number to look at because testosterone is usually bound to something called sex hormone bounding globulin. Hmm. And it gets locked into this protein and albumin, and then it goes throughout the body, but it can't be used when it's bound to the sex hormone binding globulin, SHGB. And as we get older, that, that we get more of this sex hormone binding globulin, and then we have less testosterone that's free to do anything. So we also, we, why well, we often check free testosterone or buy available free testosterone. And we calculate that by subtracting out how much sex hormone binding goblin we have. Mm. And Tonga Ali, what that does is it decreases our sex hormone binding globulin. Um, so that you have more free testosterone. What is it, by the way? Is it, a, is it a root extract? I don't, what, I don't know what it is. I'm not entirely there familiar with bunch. exactly what it is either. I, I know I, what it does, but... Another one that works is boron too. And But if you take it too much, it can increase your estrogen level. So being on two weeks, off two weeks. There's a lot of supplements that are out there. But just in general, having a supplement, having a good diet, mm -hmm. I think it's going to be supportive to good testosterone levels. Number six, sleep. Mm. is everything yeah. we talked about for the police officer oh, yeah. that's working at mm -hmm. night i mean they're waking up best form of recovery yeah by you, far you gotta have that and i tell my patients seven hours at minimum mm -hmm. there's one study that looked at men and, and old guys these are older dudes but they, if they had nine hours of sleep they had higher testosterone levels oh, but if you had it. over nine hours then they had lower levels so too much is, is there, there's a limit where you should be sure 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 but that seven to nine hours i think is an optimal way to reset things and to keep your circadian rhythm and your access your hormonal access going in men yeah um seven 
avoiding estrogen-like chemicals. And this is what has changed in our society. We are a society full yes. of plastics. And I think there's definitely a, a correlation with that to fertility and, and to all the struggles that yes. we face now that we didn't face back when we didn't have plastics and everything, you know, plastic bottles, plastic cutting boards, plastic everything. Um, soy. Soy. All things that 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 really put well, Saladino harps on this a lot. So You've seen his stuff, the carnivore and he's always talking about He that. like has uh, like uh, he doesn't use like even plastic cutting boards because he's scared you're gonna have micro mm -hmm. plastic particles that are gonna end up in your food. Yeah, and he takes it to the stream, but maybe that extreme is right. We don't have really a lot of data out there, but I do think there's an environmental component to this, and I I personally believe it's it's around. Um, some of these plastics that we see. I believe it. That's everywhere. Well, yeah. think about like the Tide Pods and even the things that you put in your dishwasher that dissolve the plastic and then wash your dishes. It's like, we've got plastics and everything if you look at it. Oh, yeah. Plastic yeah. water bottles? Yeah. I mean, everything mm -hmm. we drink. I eat all my food out of plastic now. <laughs> Dang, what am I going to do about that? <laughs> yeah, I mean, switch the glass. You know, I mean, there's yeah. all kinds of things that we can we can take a look at. Uh, and then my, my my last thing for testosterone mm -hmm. is watch your alcohol intake. Mm -hmm. I, I can tell you, I've seen so okay. many alcoholics that their testicles have shrunk down to nothing. Why? And, uh, just the alcohol has a, a deteriorous effect on testosterone production. Interesting. And, and Interesting. Testosterone. I didn't know that about it, it. Any specific alcohol in particular? Or I say just the product of <laughs> I'm just asking. <laughs> they, they've shown, they've done studies, as, as 30 minutes after drinking alcohol, your testosterone levels will go down. Mm. Wow. Okay. I got a lot of guys that can't have can't perform well. And you go is that whiskey, whiskey dick? dick? Is whiskey that dick. is that what it, it could be? Yeah, definitely, you can okay. have an issue of testosterone and and um, blood flow and everything. Yeah, wow, that's very insightful. All of those, and I love that all of those we can all take a look at and definitely improve on most of them. Yeah.